Windows 11 is officially here. Alongside the refreshed user interface and new features, it also brings some new keyboard shortcut keys. But you'd be pleased to know that almost all the shortcut keys on Windows 10 still work with the new Windows 11. This is great as you don't have to learn all new shortcuts from the start. From switching between apps to opening an emoji library, all these shortcut keys can help you work faster and efficiently, saving you from endless clicks and scrolling. That's why, in today's video, we have come up with some useful keyboard shortcuts in Windows 11 to skyrocket your productivity. So, without wasting any time, let's dive in. Let's say you're working on a project. You're writing emails to your clients, then switching to a different app, maybe your Excel sheet. And then you again jump to your emails to check their replies. You can keep coming to your taskbar and switch back and forth between these two applications. But as you have to reach your hand to your mouse or trackpad while writing something on the keyboard, it might slow down your productivity. Using a simple keyboard shortcut can help you from all these hassles. Just press Ultra plus Tab key to quickly jump between apps or navigate through multiple running apps. That way, you don't have to use your mouse or trackpad and can save lots of effort. Now using the Alt plus Tab key, you can quickly jump between apps. But to go back and forth to an app, you need to first open the app, right? Normally, all your most used apps are pinned to the taskbar. You bring your mouse cursor to the taskbar and quickly access them. But what if you can open them without even going to the taskbar? To do that, hold Windows plus number key according to the position of your pinned app. Suppose we are watching a formula on YouTube and need to open the calculator app from the taskbar that is positioned at number 2. So, we will hit the Windows plus 2 keyboard shortcut and it will open the calculator app for us. If you want to open the File Explorer app which is positioned at number 1, we will hit the Windows plus 1 keyboard shortcut. Pretty awesome, right? When you're writing a script on Microsoft Word, you often find yourself opening another app like Chrome to collect data, right? But switching from Word app to Chrome app doesn't help that much. It will be more beneficial if you could just run these two apps side by side, wouldn't it? Well, you can easily do that by pressing Windows plus left or right arrow key depending on which side you want your app to be opened. Do you store rows and rows of files and shortcuts on your desktop screen? If you do, then our next keyboard shortcut key will be helpful for you. This keyboard shortcut can come in handy when you have opened up a lot of windows and want to access your home screen. Press Windows plus D and all your desktop will be minimized so you can easily access all your files displayed on your desktop. Not everyone has the budget or space to add a secondary monitor, but there is an easier and cheaper solution to that. Just add a new virtual desktop where you can split up space for your open programs. This way, you can designate one desktop for your work and other desktop for leisure or your guest. Normally for creating a new desktop, you have to go to the task view and create as many desktops as you want. But you can do it easily just by pressing Windows plus Ctrl plus D altogether. You can even use Windows plus Ctrl plus Arrow to navigate through your virtual desktops and Windows plus Ctrl plus F4 to close whichever desktop you're currently using. When we're writing an assignment, we often find ourselves adding some data, chart or logos to a document and Windows 11 has a built-in great tool for that. In order to access it, select the Windows plus Shift plus S keys together and it will bring some different options at the top of your screen. You can select the rectangular, freeform, window or full screen snip to grab a part of the full area of your screen and paste it into your document. Often we need to find apps or files while working on something. And for that, Windows 11 has a search feature that you can access from the taskbar. But instead of moving the cursor to the taskbar, you can just press Windows plus S button to run the search feature right from your keyboard. This will definitely speed up your workflow. You find something interesting on the internet, copy it to the clipboard but forget to paste it into your document. And by the time you realize you didn't paste it, you have already copied something else. Now searching for that particular information again can be a daunting and time consuming process. But what if we tell you that you can access all of your clipboard's histories just by pressing the Windows plus V keyboard shortcut? 
even histories from yesterday. Awesome, right? Sometimes you just don't feel like writing and then you wondered, what if I can write something just by using voice commands? Well, our next keyboard shortcut can help you with that. Just hit the Windows plus H button on your keyboard and Microsoft Speech Services will appear which will turn your voice commands into text. Ever been in a situation when you're writing a status on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram or any other social networking sites but couldn't find any emoji on your computer's keyboard? Well, then press the Windows plus period key together which will bring up the emoji keyboard for you. Now, you can liven up your text with emoji library in Windows 11. You can even type a word to find which emoji you're looking for. For example, type fire or food and it'll bring that emoji for you. So, that wraps up today's video of the best useful keyboard shortcuts in Windows 11. Thanks for watching. If you found the video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and let us know your thoughts in the comments section. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.